Hey all, good night. Um, I've been trying to, 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 to do this video since this morning, but I've been so busy as um, I got interruptions and I wasn't able to do it this morning. So I'm not, I now got home and I have some peace and quiet, no disturbances, so I could do my video. I want to show you my hair. Um, I think this is a successful look. I like how it looks. It's big. My hair is full. I really like it. You must tell me what you think. And what I did was I did my physical braids, but I parted to the side and then did my braids um, like this. And then I, from the center here, I come with my hair and went down. And then some to the side. At each, at the end of each um, <clears throat> braid, what I did is I twisted like a, a bantu knot. And surprisingly, I just um, tucked, it, tucked it in and it stayed. So that means that my ends are not as straight as before, so they could stay into a bantu knot. Band to knock it out, me having to put like a, a rubber band or a woogie or whatever you call those elastic things. Um, I was quite excited about that, and after doing my hair like that, I was as an easy sleeper, I didn't have any problems. So, this much when you put rollers in your hair or put rods, you know, it, it's so difficult to sleep. Um, just setting my hair, styling my hair like that, it was easy for me to sleep with. And this is my end result. Oh, before I even go any further, what I put products I put in my hair, of course, I use the shea butter. And uh, this other product that I had, that it, I only have a small bit of it. I decided to use just the end of it. It's a organic olive oil, um, oil moisturizing hair lotion. Incredibly rich. The first, even though it's a, it says oil moisturizing. The first uh, ingredient is, is agua, water. So in my opinion, opinion I'm getting oil and um, water in my hair with this product. I always did like olive oil, these organic olive oil products. So this is what I use. I, like I said, I put the shea butter first to each section of my hair. And then I apply this at the end. I think I'll get another, another bottle. This is too, I think it's still out there. I'll get another one and I also try and get the organic shampoo and conditioner and have a complete set for my hair. Um, I think that's it. Let me turn on so you can see how what it looks like. So, uh, this is how the back looks. And now another thing to notice like with this sort of a styling. Now if I pull back my hair and notice like um, a few occasions where the ends of my hair has gotten so really, you know, really, really blocked his natural roots. And sometimes the ends here will stick out. With this styling, I could just cover my, my ends and I don't have to worry. You know, it's, everything is all hidden and stuff. So let me show you my roots. Uh, I hope you can see that. My hair is so thick now. I think to the bottom, things are closer. It's really thick and dense. I could feel it getting so dense. So, you know, I'm getting there. Um, I went shopping the other day. I uh, couldn't wait to show you, show you what I bought. I got some um, some cool elastic headbands. They're quite pretty. It has little flowers on them. This is a brown. It will go good with my outfit that I have on right now. This is a blue. It's plaited. That there. I'm excited to wear this. This is a red tip. And this is a black to the other one with the flower. And a lighter brown. Cool. Apparently, the lady who, had, who owns the store, apparently, she's going natural as well. So, of course, she'll be shopping for herself. And she shop for her store, so you know I know where to get my stuff in future. I'll just go and buy a store and get some more excited headbands. I'm kind of excited to try one right now, so we can see what it looks like. I think put the light up there so you can see it. So this is right in here. The light flowers at the side. See how cute that is? So how I put down my headband, I start like this. Let me take off my glasses. 
Let's just do this in the first. Let's try something different. And this is how I normally do my headbands. I'll slide it back like that. This is quite cool. You can see my little flower. I can make a little mock there. So I go in here like this another day. It's quite interesting. You can see that my big hair pulled off my hair because normally I sweat a lot. So today I had the my hair bit to the side and I was so busy, like I said, my hair got you know I was sweating and stuff, I got a little damp. But it still had held it through through the day. So what I'll do, I'll just put on my silk, silk scarf, which I will have been wearing for some time, but it's so hot. I live in the tropics, so it's quite hot. To be honest, I wear, when I tie my hair, I use a cotton, um, I use bandanas. It stays well on my hair. The silk scarves do not stay. By the end of the 49, before, I like should say, within a few hours, it's off my hair. It just simply slides off my hair. So I prefer to use the um, cotton, the bandanas, it's cotton fabric. All right, so let's share you with how I look, how my hair looks. Let me know what you think. And um, that's some more it. It's a cool lovely. I like a little flower at the end. Yeah. So maybe tomorrow I'll just put my hair like this and I'll be super happy. All right, folks. Good night. I've talked enough. See you later. Bye.